Hello friends and welcome today I want to talk about some trees in the pole camps that I think are potentially lane winning to cut and yet I rarely see it done. So this will be pretty quick, it's pretty easy to understand. Let's say you come to pole, ah it's blocked, no big deal, I have a sentry ready, I'm going to unblock the camp. Now if it happens to be anywhere here, no big deal, you just kill it and you get back to the lane, easy peasy. But you'll notice, although the sentry covers the whole box, there's some stuff you can't see. And this is where people will actually typically place their sentry because it forces you to do this, which is to run around and go find wherever that sentry is. And it's annoying. So sometimes it's not a big deal, right? You spend a bit of extra time, whatever. Other times it is a very big deal. For example, it's a very tough lane matchup and you have to spend, you know, an extra 10 seconds just running around looking for a sentry while your carry is getting beaten up and maybe killed. That's no good. Or even worse is as you start this like journey around the world it turns out it's over here right you're going you didn't realize the force support was following and they kill your sentry you catch a glimpse of their sentry here at the end and then yours is dead so now this camp is still blocked i lost 50 gold for nothing i spent 15 seconds over here and i gotta walk back you know this is like a 20 second commitment leaving the lane placing your sentry running around returning that's 20 seconds you're not doing anything to help the carry except to unblock this camp and if the support kills yours before you're ready it sucks so let's do something else instead same sentry but this is where you carry players come in or core players we're gonna talk about this one as well off laners you will typically start with the quelling blade supports don't i say this as the guy who sometimes buys quelling blade on supports but it's not common it's a little weird so if you core players could just do me a favor, cut this tree and cut this tree, very helpful. Because now I don't have to spend this time walking all around the camp. I can just peek my head through this tree, peek my head through this tree, and I find them all. That's two trees cut. It's about four seconds, right? You use it once, four seconds, you use it twice. Now you can go ahead and be a little more thorough because you notice there are a little like couple blind spots until I walk in. And to make it easier for me, cut these five trees. 20 seconds of your time i see most of you you're just sitting under this tower you're not doing anything so you have time to cut these trees and then come back sit under this tower mentally prep for the lane whatever you're doing while you're just sitting here afk i don't know now sometimes you're in the bounty rune and then you come participate that's fine too as you walk to lane go ahead and just cut one or two of these trees body block the creeps you're good to go and as you go you know cut this tree that's a bonus tree bonus tip that we'll actually be talking about in a future video check that out when it comes out anyways so five trees really not a lot of commitment this quelling blade you already have it could be a game changer because now you come over as a support you get the d ward fast as possible and i return to help you out i'm here to help you then this camp spawns and then we're good to go i didn't have to spend another 50 gold on another sentry and then wait another 30 seconds for that sentry to come out and this camp's been blocked for like three minutes at this point and then the lena kills it again I wanted to buy you tangos and salves and mangoes, but now I'm spending it all on sentries. Free for you to cut these trees, so please help me out. Now you core players, not that different. Over here, if the sentry's in one of these corners, no big deal, right? But it's probably not. It's probably behind this one and this one. Now, if you knew exactly where it was, it's not a huge deal, because you just like, you know, you might do something like this. You stand over here, place that sentry, and you already see it. But again, it might not be there. You might have to walk around. It might be here, but it might not be. It might be in the back behind this tree, or maybe it's over here on this tree. And on your journey around the world, the five support may have walked in and killed your sentry, which is right in the open, because that's pretty much what you have to do as the as the uh, four support if you're trying to unblock this camp in one sentry. So cut this tree, one tree. Cut this tree, two trees. These are the most common ones. If you're only gonna cut two trees, cut those trees. If you wanna help them out back here, cut this tree because now the support can just peek their head out here. See nothing. Maybe they need to come check this side. There you go. You wanna make it easy? Cut that tree. Now you see the whole thing. Five trees, 20 seconds. It's really not a lot of time for you guys. For the dire small camp, it's a bit more straightforward. So you place your sentry here or here, boop. And if it's any of these corners, you're good to go. Oh, this is the whole box, right? No, there's actually one sneaky spot behind this tree that you can't see until you walk over. Cut this tree. No excuse, dire carry players, because even if you're in the bounty room, you're walking over, you just cut this tree as you walk through, then you stand here, body block, as you come here, you cut one of these trees, bonus tip, you know, play your lane. Nothing extra from you carry players, 
except to do something in the one minute and 30 seconds. I'm not meaning to attack you guys, but it's very good to do. I'm a little frustrated. I never see this. Over here on the off lane, this one, there's a couple more trees to cut. So again, if it's in this area, you're good, but you might have to check back here. You might have checked back here and secret spot up here. So cut this tree makes it very easy to peek out here. It's pretty uncommon to like actually put the center here. It's usually in this corner. So usually you need to cut that tree, but you know, if you want, you can cut this tree to, you know, really see this side over here. Either one of these trees really will work. You know, cut this tree, you peek in this way or cut this tree, you peek in a little bit lower. Cut both if you want. We're still only at like 16 seconds at this point. Cut this tree, makes it easy to see this secret spot. You know, really want to open it up, no big deal. Cut an extra tree. That's like six trees, so like 24 seconds. So really not a huge deal for you core players. Just walk out here at the start of the game, peek your head in, cut these trees, and now your support is not as at big of a risk of getting their sentry denied. This camp continues to be blocked. This camp continues to be blocked. You lose the lane. Wah, 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 it's so sad. But you might've been able to fix it by cutting any of these trees. Support players, you can kinda cut these trees. You probably don't have a quelling blade, right? You may have tangos though. It doesn't really make sense if you're full health to cut these trees though, unless it's like super urgent. The time is like ticking down. So you're like, okay, quick, find it. And then quick, kill my own sentry you know in that case i get it but it does feel bad because you know you're kind of wasting your tango um yeah we're still not even gonna make it see it's so tough right definitely wouldn't have made it if i had to like walk around to go find that sentry um but if you happen to be in this area you happen to be a bit low on health go ahead and cut one of those trees we just talked about rather than say a random tree like this because this tree won't help you with unblocking your camp but one of these will. But of course, make sure it makes sense. You know, you're like in a fight, you're by this tree, go ahead and eat it. You know, it's, it's a little different. This is just talking about if you have the time. But carry players, off lane players, you have tons of time, cut these trees. That's it. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you found that helpful. See you in the next video.